Da -da 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 -da. What's good for guys? Matt McCoy, aka Acoustic Selection. Hope you're doing well. God's doing big things in your life. Most of the questions I get asked being a YouTuber for 15 years now, it's all about strumming. They can't figure, people can't figure out the strumming pattern. They say, what is the strumming pattern? How do you figure out a strumming pattern? That kind of thing. And I, I realized when you're first learning guitar, the whole issue with strumming is going to be one of the most difficult parts. That's just a fact. What I've just realized lately as I've been learning new, new song, new, more, playing more and more songs, that kind of thing, is so often it helps me to do a half strum before I start that note. So I would kind of lead into any note, like a... Over the mountains and sea, your river runs with love. I will open up my heart and let the healer set free. Or like, blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name. Blessed be the half strum of the love. Half strum. Blessed be the name. So basically, whatever chord you're on, you're going to play the top couple two or three strings by itself and then a full strum so for example on a g chord like in the two bottom strings fifth and six a g chord is all six strings but when you when it comes to a song and you get that part i'm treat, i'm treating song. so you're just strumming the top two or three strings then a full strum maybe on a c add nine or a c top two so I'm trading half whole, half whole, half whole, half whole. See that? So, raise in the race, as we listen. a rich man be. I was lost, but now I'm found. Goodbye, but now. So I thought, man, anytime I learn something, I always say I want to be a channel of God's blessings, not a reservoir. So when I learn any kind of little tip or I find something mentally with music or whatever could be helpful for me, I always get to share it with you guys and gals out there too. So when you're learning your next song, try to do a half strum. Instead of always seeing a G chord and strumming all six strings, which all six strings are involved with the G chord, try to lead into it with just a little half strum. And then you're, you're leading in it, then a full strum, and then you linger until it's time to come. Listen to this name of the Lord. Listen to the name. Listen to the name of the Lord. Listen to your glorious name. Give and take away. Give and take away. Now, then that, all I'm doing is a half strum and then linger. If you struggle with strumming, guys, don't forget I've got a course called the Ultimate Strumming Course. So, um, somebody's writing me saying, can you bring the fire? My boys and I have a little firewood business. Somebody keeps texting me, can you bring the firewood Saturday? So, we've been super busy this time of year. I feel like I'm a full-time lumberjack. I always up splitting wood, sawing wood, that kind of thing, which I enjoy. I love getting outside, being on the farm. But I feel like I'm just a full-time firewood guy now. I'm, I'm like, I'm supposed, to, I'm supposed to be a YouTuber. So, anyway, by the way, I always forget to say it. So please smash that little like button when you see my videos. Hit that little thumb, thumbs up. Makes YouTube put it out there in the atmosphere, that kind of thing. When you're doing strumming, guys, practice the half strum. Hopefully it can be a blessing to you. I've got a full strumming course over at AcousticSelection.com. All one word, AcousticSelection.com. I even now sell hats. So if you're thinking about um, a hat, I've got a, my other channel, Country Song Teacher Hat, and Acoustic Selection Hat. So... For literally for 10 years, I've tried to get these for sale. Nobody would make individual hats, and now they do. So you can get the Flex Fit or the, um, uh, the what's it called? The Richardson, that's what this is called. The net back or the f full black one Flex Fit. Either one over at AcousticSelection.com. So if you want to support the channel, go check it out. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow for another video. A little Four Chord Friday. Let's go.